This video has been brought to you by Starbucks. So you guys, uh, welcome to my channel, The X-Ray Hex Show. Um, today I'm going to bring you a video about cards. <laughs> I've been collecting a lot of cards uh, lately. Uh, first, I want to send out a shout out to Ross Cards and Coffee. Uh, they're located at 267 North El Camino Real in Encinitas, California. Uh, make sure you stop by. They have like tons of cards at affordable prices. So if you're a collector, you can go there. You can buy these and you can also buy the slabs um, for affordable prices. Uh, they're not like everybody else who overcharges and stuff. Um, also, I've been uh, grabbing some from eBay, as you guys can see. I've been busy <laughs> grabbing, collecting cards. Um, who knows? Maybe it'll be my retirement fund. Maybe it won't. But I'm still having fun collecting. Um, when I went to the coffee shop, I found uh, this uh, Prism Tom Brady, oh, sorry, Select Tom Brady card. And then I found an Emmett Smith Select. And for my Raiders, <laughs> uh, Henry Ruggs the third. By the way, go Raiders, go Dodgers. <laughs> uh, I also found a Kyle, Kyle, Kyler Murray. For five bucks and uh aaron donald man for some reason the rams are not getting any respect even though they've won the super bowl the wrecking crew his cards are going really cheap so i'm just picking up as many as i can uh aaron donald is going to be a hall of famer regardless he, everything he's done he's one of the greatest football players i've seen then i found this josh allen buffalo bills and they gave me these three cards I don't know much about baseball guys <laughs> so bam 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 <laughs> Let's see so this is better um better lighting here so i'm gonna open up a, a couple of packs some of you guys open up um card packs i'm gonna open up mail <laughs> mail that i received and uh, i'm gonna show you the cards that i've ordered it's nothing uh, too fancy, nothing too serious, but if you like this, uh, you know, uh, continue watching, comment, don't forget to uh, leave a comment, uh, subscribe, and uh, I'm going to open up the first pack here, see what I ordered. I don't remember what I ordered exactly. Who is this? Oh, it's another Aaron Donald. Tons of tape. If you guys have watched the other videos, it's like, uh, they're overdoing it with the tape. But I guess I can rip it off. I don't know. Yeah, I can rip it off. Love the protection. This guy gets an, a 10, if I can get the card out. So the reason I picked up this Aaron Donald, it's because it's numbered. There, you can see it there. numbered it's number five of 25 so i had to pick this one up i can't see it really can't focus the camera but maybe if i go like this cover the some of the sun it's a see-through aaron donald and it's one of 25 i picked up a cooper cup a couple months ago a couple weeks ago so that's the first card it's pretty cool and uh, I'm, I'm going to keep bringing these videos. As far as the reselling, like I said, I've, I have too much inventory. It's moving really slow right now. So I decided not to do any reselling videos because merchandise is moving really, really slow. And, uh, but we are selling. We're getting a couple sales here and there. Like yesterday, I sold the Detroit Lions. Uh, I guess you can call it a windbreaker. And it sold for uh, $35 plus shipping. So it was like $41. And um, I have to pack it up and ship it after this. I uh, found, found another Kyle Murray. I don't know why the camera looks a little too bright. Anyways. Kyle Murray. This is not numbered, but it's really cool. I like the color. The 
the burgundy, the burgundy and the red. It's really cool. Yeah. And um, all this stuff here I've been getting for like a couple of dollars, three dollars, two dollars. And uh, graded, I've seen them, they go for a couple hundred dollars. So who knows, man? Maybe I'll have some of these graded and pay the rent. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, this is a uh, Justin Herbert. It's a uh, 2021, I believe. I picked it up because it says MVP. It's um, nothing too special, but I liked it, and I picked up two of them. So one of these packs might have the other one. Anyways, I don't want to take the tape off and ruin it right now. I'll take it off with patience and take my time with it. And uh, I've been picking up the players that uh, I've, I've been seeing are are like the people are, are like right now, like um, you know the Lucas and the Herberts. And I haven't heard this guy mentioned yet, like Kyle Murray. Maybe a, about a year ago, maybe he was mentioned. I don't know. I really haven't heard on, on the YouTube videos people talk, talking about him or um, Trey Young. Trey Young. So these are cards that I'm picking up for really cheap. Even the, the graded ones, the 10, I'm picking up for like 20 bucks, I believe. So who knows? Maybe one day. Oh, I think this one has a... So I picked up a lot of uh, Kyle Murray. I picked up a couple of uh, Justin Herberts. This is a rookie card right here. Rookie, see the RC rookie. Picked up a Justin Herbert. Um, I've been picking these up for like a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, and then. Um, if you have them graded, I mean, they look in excellent shape. Like the corners are not bent. Uh, there's no, no white. Maybe I'd probably give this a nine. PSA nine, maybe. But who knows? When they take the microscope, who knows? <laughs> you know, take the microscope to your card and see uh, what they can get. Maybe they'll give you an eight or a five. Who knows? Um, here's another Aaron Donald, oh, one of those see-through cards. I believe I picked up, I picked this card up for three dollars. See-through. There's nothing in the back. There's no numbers. Nothing. I thought I thought they were interesting, so I picked them up. Who knows? They, you never know. It might not be worth anything. So I'm making. I'm keeping this video short because the other one I did a maybe I don't know. It was really long. Let's see what's in here. What's in here? Oh, there's a couple cards in here? No, well, just one. They put paper. And uh, this is a Luis Roberts. Again, I don't know much about baseball. I picked it up because it, uh, it was really cheap. It was like $9.00. Nine dollars, Louise Robert, a PSA ten. If he's good, he's good. If he sucks, well, nine dollars. No brainer, right? Uh, let's see what else we got over here. Oh, gotta cover up the addresses. Oh, these are just. I guess they throw in a couple of uh, base cards here. A DJ Moore, Alvin Kamara, oh, Drew Locke, Christian McCaffrey, and T. Y. Hilton. They threw these in the in the in the pack. Who knows? I'm, I'll look them up. But anyways, guys, thank you for stopping by. Like. Um, I do have a full-time job, and then uh, when I get out of work, I, I I collect cards, so I open up some of these cards. And thank you for stopping by. 
And sometimes I open packs in my channel. Sometimes I talk about reselling. Sometimes I talk about collecting, collecting. I mostly collect toys like the wrestlers. Uh, just right now I haven't been interested in collecting or reselling. <laughs> so I've been uh, collecting baseball cards, uh, bas uh, football cards, basketball cards, baseball cards. I haven't gotten into the soccer and the UFC yet, but these are cool, man. They're not the same cards that we grew up with as kids. <laughs> they make them look so cool. This is a uh, Dak Prescott, Dallas Cowboys. Not a fan, but for the price that I got it, it's like really cheap. Two or three dollars. Uh, let me know on the comments like which is, what's the most expensive card you've you've found like i know that the most expensive cards are the ones that have autographs oh there's a few cards in here so let's see what we got hmm sometimes uh when you order cards they give you a couple of free ones But um, I'm guessing these guys must suck because they didn't put any they didn't put any sleeves or anything on them. You never know, you might find you might find some extra cash here somewhere. Okay. Uh, so the first card the guy gave me Gary Harris from the Denver Nuggets. It's a mosaic. Nice and shiny, I'll probably put in a sleeve. It doesn't look damaged yet, so. DeJounte Murray, who knows? Maybe these guys suck, but I have, I have to look them up. These Again, these are free, they threw them in the pack, so. Gordon Hayward, another mosaic, shiny. What else did they throw in here? Devontae Graham. Wow. Okay, this one I like. I grew up watching these guys, you know. Uh, John Stockton, Jeff Hornacek, Carl Malone, uh, Russell. You name them. They, they were great players. Uh, I love this one. Wow. John Stockton. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you for giving me the extra cards. Uh, I don't know who this guy is. His name is Forkin Corkmas. Wow. Got some extra, I got some bonus cards on this one. That was pretty cool. And the, the card that I was looking for is the Kyler Murray. Uh, this is a numbered uh, jersey. If I can read the number. I'm a little, a little blind, guys. Uh, it's in the back, maybe. I believe it's 84 of 99. 84 of 99, but check out the, the jersey. It's Kyle Murray. Let's see if I can focus the number. Can't focus, man. This camera sucks. I'm working on it. I'm working on getting a new camera. But this is the card I was waiting for. This is this is gorgeous. Gorgeous card, man. Next to my brand new John Stockton. Like a champ, son. <laughs> like a champ. Um, I also bought a whole bunch of Bo Jacksons. I'm waiting for those. Um, I know nobody knows Bo anymore. Nobody knows Bo. <laughs> but uh, Bo Jackson was a really good player. He played baseball and football before Deion Sanders. 
And that's what I've been finding out, that a lot of the people are not looking at the old cards, or I don't know, maybe they're, nobody cares anymore about the Charles Barkleys, the David Robinsons, um, Sean Camps, Gary Paytons, you know, Hakeem Olajuwon, the Dream. I don't know. There's a lot of cards that are going for so cheap out there. But again, we, we are going through a recession. A lot of tape. All right, so let me let me, let me tap into my my ninja magic. That's a lot of tape, bro. But my card, priceless. It's safe. I think there might be a few in here. I don't know. Let me open it up. Let's see. Let's find out. Ooh. So. Justin Herbert. Boom. Justin Herbert. Another Herbert. On the back it says Panini 2021. So it's the second year, it's not the first year. But another Justin Herbert. And another Justin Herbert. So I ended up buying, it looks like five Justin Herberts for five bucks. They're not the first, they're not the rookie years, but uh, I'll, I'll take them. Justin Herbert, his stuff is going for a lot of money right now. Money. Have a lot of garbage in them. Ooh, shiny. Is this? So as you guys already know, I started collecting this year and uh, there's two cards in here. Like this is the man they were talking about like for months and I wasn't able to get a card. Just like I can't get a Luca right now. But um, I'm talking about Luca rookie. So this is Jason Tatum. Jason Tatum, I got a shiny purple card, PS, PSA 10. And another Jason Tatum, PSA 10, beautiful cards, uh, NBA hoops, told you, been collecting as much as I can, so, oh, there you go, you can see it better that way, that's the shiny, shiny silver, and this is uh, NBA hoops, it's uh, purple, Jason Tatum. These are 17, 18, no, 2019. These are 2019. I don't remember his rookie year, but I have to look him up. I think it might've been 18 when he came out, but uh, Two, 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 two. I got these $20 each. I don't know how much he's going for right now. I'll research it and I'll let you guys know. But uh, as far as cards, that's it, guys. Keep collecting. Keep hustling. Keep doing. Keep living your life to your best. Uh, don't forget to visit my boys at uh, Ross Cards and Coffee in Encinitas, California. Look them up on Google and you should be able to find them. You can have a cup of coffee. You can open up cards. You can talk to the boys. Uh, they're really friendly, really cool. And they have tons of stuff, tons of knowledge. And once in a while, if you're nice, they might give you something for free. You never know. Uh, I ended up getting two cards for free. And that's all I found this week. Like as far as collectibles, like 
Um, actually, I have more that I have to open up, but uh, I don't think you guys have time for that. But some of you guys open up cards. I open up envelopes of stuff that I buy uh, on eBay. And uh, I mean, I'm having a lot of fun, man. Um, so you never know. Some of these might be garbage. I'm still taking a risk, and I'm having fun doing it. Look at all these envelopes. Look at all these envelopes. And sometimes you get bonuses, like some, like this guy. With, when I bought the Prescott, I, I wasn't expecting all these other guys. I don't even know. I mean, the only one that I like out of the whole thing is the John Stockton. I should put it in a, in a sleeve. Again, beautiful card. And as far as resales, it's going slow, but it's going. And uh, I'm also posting some of these back online for a little bit a little bit higher so I can see if I can make some profit out of it. So look out, X-Ray the 56, and uh, see if you find anything you like. Guys, keep dreaming, keep hustling, believe in yourselves. The hardest part is doing. You have to go out there and get it. Hustler Hacks. Shout out to Hustler Hacks. He doesn't know me, but I watch his stuff. Um, go out go out and get it, guys. If you want it, if you have a dream, believe in it and get it done. I have like a minute left. I ran out of, out of things to say. But thank you guys for watching. Until next time, stay safe. Love you guys. And... Peace. Yeah, let me see. Peace.